guys, it's Laura back, so I'm back with another request. I'm gonna put it was requested on my personally on my Instagram. Thank you for your request. I'm sorry for the like a little bit long wait. So I'm like I need to do some because I have some requests on my Instagram, so I need to do that too. So uh I have no idea how to read it. I'm gonna sorry for my bad reading because I have no idea how to read it. It's Budak Belakang, a theme. I'm not gonna try to read the name because I'm gonna make out of myself clown. So that's that. But this person, this person said that like to see my review to the song. So I don't know. Let's see what I think about this song. I have no idea what to. I have no idea what to expect from this. But we're gonna see what we have. So yeah, yeah. record new video. Screen recording is on. Wait, okay. Full screen and let's see. Double F Studio present. Okay, three, two, one. Let's go. Mhm. Mm Ooh, that's a nice shot. Okay. I like the effect in his voice. It sounds like... Okay. Okay. I like his flow. I like the effect on voice that, like, when it sounds like deeper and higher voice. Okay, the course is sketchy. Okay. The hair though. The toilet paper. Ooh. The location is beautiful. Okay. Pop off. I'm getting goosebumps. The beat is fire though. That's incredible. Guess what is from drone? I like the line, speak the truth through all the youth. Okay, the tiger shirt. That chorus is Kesha. Easy to vibe. Ooh, that's cool though. What's going on? Oh. 
Okay. That feels so short, honestly. Quarrels was oh, I turn on something. Quarrels was super catchy. Okay, that was some nice track. I'm pretty sure the message was really good because from the English parts, since I don't really understand the language, but from the English parts, I like that. Especially the part where they let the youth speak the truth, like, that's yes, like, and what can I say, that was some really good, they have some good beat and rappers, like, I'm sure it's from Malaysia, this track, and honestly, I like that. The beat in the chorus was super fire and was super catchy. It's like, dude, you just vibe into the chorus, and I like that. It was interesting since I don't know how to explain, but it was some interesting experience. I like that kind of like I said, the effect on the voice of it and sound like uh, two voices. I like the effect a lot on like when they use that thing, so I like that. I also like that, like, the rap was really good. I think it was three three rappers, maybe four, but like I like that. I like the locations. That one on the mountain, that was so beautiful. And uh what more? What more I like? I li like I enjoy that. It's definitely not like something I would listen constantly because if you not familiar with me, I'm not biggest like uh, rap fan. I don't usually listen a lot of rap. I li listen to rap sometimes when I'm on YouTube, just turn on playlist and listen to rap. But I don't usually listen to rap. I like um, a rap with uh, vocals like that type mix, more like mix stuff, not just rap. So that's that. that. But definitely I would enjoy to bop the song. Like I think that song would bop in the car a lot with a good beat. Like Malaysian songs, especially rap songs, have really great beat and I feel like they would bop in the car just to know with the music and stuff so i guess it's gonna be my kind of review <laughs> sorry if it, i'm not like hyped today i'm kind of a little bit off a little bit down mood with my kitty panda which she, not this one <laughs> she's sleeping there it's kind of like sick so i'm not like in the best mood because you know she was sick a couple weeks ago and she had temperature now she's having something trouble with breathing so that's that, but I guess uh, it is what it is. She's gonna push through. I'm pretty sure she's gonna get healthy and strong kitties. So, and see you in the next reaction. Bye.